नेचर मिस्टिफाइज मी नेचर स्केर्स मी नेचर अट्रैक्ट्स मी नेचर रिपेल्स मी नेचर इज इन द डे नेचर इज इन द नाइट नेचर इज विजिबल नेचर इज हिडन चेंजिंग एंड येट सो कॉन्स्टेंट डायनेमिक एंड येट सो स्ट्रॉन्ग नेचर इज अबव ऑल नेचर इज एट द बॉटम ऑफ ऑल दिस बुक डी मिस्टिफाइंग द नेचर इज एन अटेम्प्ट टू कनेक्ट द यंग जनरेशंस to the science to the engineering that the nature does and we are still trying best to achieve the perfection like the nature does almost 6 uh, 6 uh, to 7 years back when we were in our odf campus of iit hyderabad we were teaching a course on nature inspired materials engineering and where we thought that this is something quite interesting might be for the school students as well and that's how we started thinking about writing a book or related to the nature and its inspiration while you read through this book you will encounter few organisms that you do not like few organisms that you are scared of few organisms that make you feel wow and ultimately we think that you will be able to appreciate how nature offers perfection offers creativity and innovation so if you go through this book you will find that there are a lot of technical nerd zones but the interesting thing is that you can go through the book from beginning to end without going through that nerd zones so in that way even the school students of standard 8 onwards they can read and enjoy the nature's inspirations nature's learnings it talks about lotus leaf lotus grows in the mud and yet it is always so clean lizards lizards amble around on the walls but it never rarely falls we look at beautiful peacock feathers but do you know that it doesn't have colors where do the colors come from there are no pigments in it for the curious minds one can go through the technical nerd zones in which you can get more technical aspects of the various engineering uh, nature of the nature's inspirations we have conceptualized this book based on the nano we have tried to bring the nano uh, for us the nano world may be comparatively new but nature has mastered us on the nano long centuries back so this is how we conceptualized this book that how the nature can teach us about the nano hierarchical structures we also feel privileged to have the foreword for this book written by none other than professor h c barma who is a well known author for his book concept of physics and that is not all let us go beyond it does not finish here for there is nature it is beyond permanent and temporary it is evolving and non stationary so have a pleasure reading the book